So my name is Tamara Jackson Zims. I'm a professor and extension plant pathologist at the University of Nebraska Lincoln. I work with diseases that are often big challenges for many of our producers, and so we help them diagnose, prevent, and manage those diseases to help them minimize the losses to their bottom line, hopefully helping them improve their livelihoods. My lab is working on a disease called bacterial leaf streak, and that disease is caused by a bacterium called Xanthomonas vesicola pathovar vasculorum, and we just confirmed that disease in 2016 here in Nebraska, which was the first time it was confirmed in the United States. One of our biggest concerns about this disease is because the symptoms may look very similar to other diseases that we have in Nebraska. In fact, it can look very similar to a fungal disease called gray leaf spot, and that disease is very common across Nebraska and in other states as well. And very commonly in the past two years, we've had people misidentify bacterial leaf streak make a fungicide application that didn't control it, and it's costing farmers a lot of money when they make mistakes like that. And so that's part of our job, is to help teach them what to look for. One of the things that we try to do is to try to minimize the impact of the disease on our farmers. One of the ways that it does that is that it affects overall plant health by minimizing the leaf area. And so the more leaf area of the plants that are affected, the more the yield loss could be. And of course, that reduces our farmer's bottom line by reducing overall yield. And so we hope that we can help them increase yield by better managing this disease and also to save money by preventing misapplications of foliar fungicides that may not help them control it. We're doing a lot of different types of research on bacterial leaf streak. And the first parts of our research were funded very early on by the Nebraska Corn Board because they sponsor research on problems that affect our Nebraska corn producers. And we very much appreciate their support. In addition, we've also gotten support from other state and federal entities like the USDA APHIS Farm Bill that many people are familiar with. Careers in agriculture are wonderful because you get to help influence people's lives by helping them improve their operations.